Hey, Pasadena Foursquare Church, Pastor Max here, and I am so excited to share this Sunday morning as we continue our summer series called With. And something that I've been thinking about lately is this idea that danger leads to fear, fear leads to control, control doesn't necessarily lead to the dark side, but fear does lead into how we interact with God and how we just relate with God. So instead of just sharing, I wanted to show some pictures to see how this actually looks like in real life. So first and foremost, life under God. And this is the idea that when we just try to control our relationship and the narratives under religion, rituals, or morality, this is what our relationship with God looks like. It looks like us being just squashed down by God right? This doesn't look pleasant at all. So that is life under God. The second one is life over God. And I believe this is where a lot of our modern Christianity is right now. But to give a example, the way that I like to see it is like a spiritual buffet where you come to this buffet and you look at what Christianity, what God, what Jesus has to offer and you might pick and choose and say, oh, this is great. Yeah, I like this. Oh, what Jesus did here, that's fantastic. Let's grab that. But in the midst of it, you might say, ah, oh, but this, yeah, this thing that God says, no, nah, I think I found it better somewhere else. This other place that offers a spiritual buffet, that's better. So this is the idea that life over God is we pick and choose what we want to implement in our spiritual life. And ultimately, it's a sign of control because we're not submitting or we're not being open to what God is doing in our whole life. So it's a sense of control. The third is life for God. And now this might seem great initially, and it has good intentions to begin with, but sometimes it can lead to a lot of brokenness, bitterness, and sorry, Pastor Dennis, I don't have another B. I'll just say just anger. All right, so life for God is just all about the mission, the mission. And you look at people, you look at things, you look at circumstances to complete the mission, whether the mission's good or not. But the mission is what is the priority. Not God, not your, not your relationship with God, but just the mission. So life for God is this idea of doesn't matter who or what you are or what you contribute to me as a relationship but all that matters is you're a way to get the mission done lastly life with god and look how happy this guy looks like he's in relationship with god life with god and life with god is rooted in faith surrender and security and it's rooted out of the scripture deuteronomy 31 8 and it says the lord is the one who goes ahead of you. He will be with you. He will not fail you or forsake you. Do not fear or be dismayed because this life, this life with God is an invitation to not live in fear, to not live in insecurity, but rather faith and surrender. So we'll see you this Sunday, 10 a.m., whether it's in person or online. Can't wait to see you. See you then.